Hi there, Crystal Thompson here with another inspiration using June 2020 Wit Kit and we're doing some watercolor stamping. We are going to be using the Love in the, Live in the Sunshine stamps that included in the kit and doing some very fast watercoloring using some Zig Clean Color Markers. You're going to need two colors or two variations of shade for the same color, so two types of green and two types of brown. We're going to begin by actually coloring on the stamp and then we're going to bring in a, another color that's going to be a little bit darker and come on the edges. I really like the Zig Clean Color Markers because you can really put the detail where you want that color. If you don't have watercolor markers, you can totally use regular watercolors. Just add that color to your brush and then place it on the stamp. We're going to do this uh, brown and then we're going to use the darker brown on the edge. Using our water brush, we are going to add the water directly onto our cardstock. And I got to tell you, I'm not using watercolor cardstock. This is just Nina, 110 pound. And I'm going to hold it down and really allow that water to absorb the stamp. And I got to let you know that if you add a ton of water, you're going to kind of lose the image. But other than that, it is a very easy way. And so I thought I would create a slim line, slim line card with this as they are super popular. Then I'm going to use the happiest comes happiness comes in waves. We're going to do it this again. And I thought I would use um, the same idea of the watercolor stamping on the edge. So it kind of took away from the clean and simple look that we were getting here but I really enjoy layering these two. So as you can see, I'm gonna do one generation and two generation stamping, and that way you get some different looks. Once your watercolor cardstock has dried, which is gonna be about five to 10 minutes because it's not watercolor, um, you really wanna get this nice and dry. Add your adhesive to the back and be sure that you use a lot of it or something really strong because it's not watercolor cardstock, it tends to curl. So once we got that going, I'm gonna flip over my brown cardstock and now we have our slimline card. Last but not least, I'm gonna bring in some glittery brown Nuvo drops just to add a little bit of shimmer and shine to this card and embellish it. And guys, this is a super easy way to utilize the other parts, the other components of the Live in the Sunshine stamp set included in the WIT 2020 card kit. That does it for me. I hope you enjoyed this super easy, quick tutorial on watercoloring with your stamps, making a slim line style card using the June 2020 card kit. Be sure to click on the links below and take you down to the Unity Stamp Company where you can purchase this kit or you can subscribe to get the kit every three months. Be sure to like, comment, and share this video and click on my photo to subscribe. Thanks so much.